First of all, Obasan just should have apologized to Nigerians in the first place for even imposing this contraption we have. Without Obasan just in just increases, we will not have this type of government in place. The man was living in a hurry. He imposed two clearly inefficient people on Nigeria. And the thing is coming back to haunt him. So why should we be concerned about the wailings of Obasanjo when this, what is happening to him is purely the backfire, backfiring of a machine he put on the ground? Why should we be concerned? Obasanjo's own boys, his own machine he put on the ground, is now turning back against him. And then we are concerned, we are all concerned. No, Obasanjo should have first of all apologized to Nigeria. Before writing a letter to Obas to Jonathan, he should have written a letter to Nigerians saying, I am sorry for getting to you where to where we are today. He's not behaving as if he's the victim. Writing that letter, he's one of us. He's not one of us. He's the architect of this problem. He was the one that imposed somebody with half liver and half brain on us. Somebody we have liver, somebody we have brain imposing on us. And that's where we have the problem we are today. And then he's not lamenting and writing letters. He should lament for himself, not lament for us. Thank you. He should, sir, he should sir, feel sir. sorry. Sir, I have a question.